title of this lecture is Actions of Muscle. We need to be able to figure out what it is that the muscles are actually doing. This will be handy because when you know this, a lot of the muscles are named for what they do or named for what they're attached to. So in either way, it's good to know these things. First one is the easiest one, and that is flexion. Flexion simply means decreasing the angle between bones. Decreasing the angle between bones. These first two that I'm going to name most commonly occur at a hinge joint. Notice that I did not make an absolute statement here because they can occur in places that aren't hinge joints as well. For example, the wrist. The wrist flexes. That decreases the angle between these two bones here. Okay, But the wrist is technically called an ellipsoidal joint. But every one of these movements here between here and here, here and here, the whole finger right there, that's all flexion. The movement at your elbow is flexion as well. What would you call this action? What am I doing with my fingers? I am increasing the angle. This is, starts with an E. Close. You have the X part right. Extension. This is extension. Extension is increasing. Increasing the angle between bones. So, uh, like I said, mostly these are going to occur at hinge joints. The next ones uh, we're looking at here are ones that most often occur at ball and socket joints. These two are very often confused because they're almost the same spelling. In fact, just flip one letter. To move away from the midline, it's something called abduction. Abduction is moving a bone away from the midline. Remember that imaginary midline that goes to the center of the, of the body that would bisect the body on the sagittal plane. Moving away from that is abduction. So these typically, these two, these two movements that are opposite of one another would occur at what type of joint? Not a hinge, but what? Ball and socket joints, where these are going to be. Ball and socket joint. Now this one is so close bringing it back is so close that we're just going to flip this letter here. We're from abduction to adduction. Which means moving a bone toward the midline. Moving a bone back toward the midline. Okay. So flexion, extension, abduction, adduction. Uh, then these are the main ones. We're going to add just a few more to our list here that are not as commonly used. Next one is elevation. Moving bone superiorly up. Okay. Closing the jaw as an example of elevation. You're lifting the jaw up. Did I tell you what the opposite of elevation is? Depression. It's sad. Did somebody say it? Depression. Depression. That's why that little giant pop where the giant popsicle stick they stick on your tongue if you're at the doctor's office. They don't do it as much anymore. It's called a tongue depressor because it's pushing down depression moving bone inferiorly down okay then we have a few just odds and end ones to, to add to our list these are not by any means a comprehensive list but this gets a pretty good start rotation 
is really spinning but not necessarily all the way around spinning um, Because your shoulder technically rotates, but so does your C1 and your C2. And you don't want C1 and C2 to rotate all the way around, otherwise you, your neck would snap. All right, next. <clears throat> Last two are kind of weird and very specific. They are plantar flexion and dorsiflexion. Plantar flexion, this is both to do with the foot. Plantar flexion is pointing your toe. Dorsiflexion is bringing your foot back. There's my foot. There you go. There's plantar flexion. I'm bringing it back like that. That's dorsiflexion. Plantar flexion, dorsiflexion. Plantar flexion, dorsiflexion. Yay! Here's rotation. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Rotation. Um, depression. Here we go. Ah. Abation. Uh, ah. Uh, perfect. Uh. What else we got? This is gonna be tricky. <laughs> Cram my whole body underneath here. That's my arm, everyone. <laughs> that it's my that's not helping. <laughs> this is abduction. There's my armpit, everybody. <laughs> and this is what? Adduction. Sorry, that was a really hard one to illustrate on the thing. Okay. What's that? Flexion. This is? Okay. This is? Flexion. This is? Good deal. All right. So that's the basic movements of muscle.